Hey everyone, Viral here again. Uh, what I want to show you today is making this template to turn these pillars behind me into spirals. So I'll show you it in action. Line up the blocks. And you just run it up. Just like all the others. But look at that lovely pattern. And same template on this one, which is the other one, but two of the colours cut out. So, how do we go about making a spiral? copy this piece out. We're looking to make this shape, which as you can see is lower than the and stretched out on one side and higher and stretched out on the other. The two side ones don't really matter. Or I all works. And you're gonna need one of these, a quarter voxel. Shroden a cat posted a video on how to make these. Paste it in there and it's at the top, so paste it up again. And if I just paint that, one second, you can see it stretched the voxel so it's a full voxel length, half in the box and half out. So I'll make my three above the grid. Copy this. Okay. Now, align it. I need to align my cursor. Oh, sorry, my viewing angle is terrible here. Right. So that's it. In the ground. I want it in that corner, so it'll be furthest away. And I just need to line it into the box. I'm pointing that. So up to the same height paste it there and then rotate it twice so it'll be in the bottom corner and mirror it and the bottom corner so not the exact same shape but these two corners are the important ones How do you make a template? So three by three and drag that three up. Heal it. So we want the obviously healed inlay and we'll put a marker block in it which needs to match your pillars so this is three away on a mine. Hopefully. Yep. And we only want the corners of it, so we'll just delete the rest. So if we take our shape again, and paste it. So, line it up, one above, and one below. Switch the green, rotate it towards you, anti-clockwise, move around again. again I can't believe it's actually working without a grid <laughs> okay and that should hopefully be a template so we'll copy out and try it Something looks good from this angle. Yep. 
Yep. The next bullet. So, so then, how do we make variations of this? Same as four. Do your dart up. Heal it. <coughs> this time if you delete them, but leave the middle. And I think I'll actually change my colour for the marker block. Take it away again. And then just copy this template. And if you shift click and paste it without air. And as you see, it's reshaped the center block. So if you can template that. And now I want to try it on here. The same spiral, but it's around a small pillar. Okay. So, so can I get rid of these? So, what other shapes can you make? Let's remove those. again. So one side, turn it around to the opposite corner and paste it diagonally. Now if you copy this, And in this corner, you know, so cut it into a triangle. So, copy that. Make your 3x3 three three grid again. like market making sure I use marker blocks it just makes placement so much easier okay my shape above and below again If we try this one, you'll get something similar to this second pillar. Except with a much thicker stripe down it. Okay. So, 
Now if you do the same as you did with the first one, leave a, a bit of heel dart in the middle. Actually, that shouldn't have worked. That's because I've still got the pace with that air off. Right. So, doing that again. Since notice it's left the gold in, and this one shouldn't actually have the pillar in either. Yep, everyone makes mistakes, me included, and this is my technique. So, without the pillar. <coughs> so yeah, you can just use this one 